Hello, friends in Christ. I am Father Ricky Montañez, the parish priest of San Roque Parish, Bagumbayan, Diocese of Cabao. Ang kwento ng Ebanghelyo ngayong ikaapat na linggo ng Kwaresma ay ang pagpapagaling ni Jesus sa isang taong ipinanganak na bulag. The Pharisees take issue that the healing happens on a Sabbath. They discredit Jesus by focusing on the fact that Jesus has failed to observe Jewish law and even condemned the once blind man as a fraud, saying he was born in sin. In most gospel accounts of Jesus' healing miracles, faith is a requisite. This kind of faith is personal, not intellectual. You may know all about faith, all about who Jesus is, and pass every exam related to who He is, and still not be His follower. Here we see the difference between Christology, the study of Christ, and Christianity, the following of Christ. Ang pananampalataya ay buong pagtitiwala kay Jesus bilang Diyos at aking tagapagligtas. I believe in His promises. I believe in His power over sin and death in my blindness. If we look closely, there is more here than meets the eye. It wasn't just the sight of the blind man's eyes that was restored. He actually gained insight into who Jesus is and the impact He made on His life. Unlike the Pharisees who continue to persist in darkness, not acknowledging the truth before them, the once blind man can really see who Jesus is, the Messiah. Let us pray for a deepening of faith in moments of trial and doubt when we are seemingly asked, do we believe in the Son of Man? We can answer confidently, Yes, we do believe, Lord.